hello! Hello and welcome back to Brickle, my name is Brittany and today we are looking at the final trailer for Aquaman. I try not to double up on trailer reactions but I am so pumped for this Aquaman film that, you know what, I'm gonna make an exception. So without further ado, let's jump into the final Aquaman trailer reaction. Legend has it that one day, a new king will come who will use the power of the trident to put Atlantis back together again. This is the exact spot that Volko gave me my first swimming lesson. I already know how to swim. Not even close. You have to forget all the teaching of the surface world. Go deeper. One cover your Atlantean instincts. He spent his entire life training. Training to be the best. My parents made me what I am. I am the protector of the deep. Protector of the deep. In this trident resides the power of Atlantis. In the wrong hands, it would bring destruction. But in the hands of the true heir, it would unite above and below. The time has come for Atlantis to rise again. You must stop him. And how do you propose we do that? By retrieving this. I already got one of those. <laughs> not like this one, you don't. The war is coming to the surface, whether you like it or not. Ooh! Yeah. Hey! I always knew you were special. If you believe you'd be the one to unite our two worlds. Atlantis has always had a king. Now I need something more. Okay, yeah, I'll dig it. But what could be greater than a king? So that one there was a bit more of a traditional trailer as compared to the sneak peek extended footage released previously. And while watching that, I really started to understand, I mean, I did see it last time, but why this can be seen as an underwater Star Wars. Because think about it, in water, you have 360 degrees, like, a range of motion. And you have that in space as well. So the atmosphere in that sense is very similar. So they've taken that and they've taken the neons of the deep, because you know how some fish and coral are just bright and vibrant and you can see how that's really affected Atlantis and created something that is just beautiful but it's also different from like you can't really say neon without thinking about Blade Runner and those sorts of films but this is a this is a different neon this is I want to say a natural neon a a angel fish neon I don't really know how else to describe it got to see a bit more of Nicole Kidman kicking butt you know what I'm actually starting to warm to her as Atlanta but the biggest thing we got to see is a lot more, and I mean a lot more of Volko. So there we have Willem Dafoe, who a lot of people thought would make a fantastic Joker in a bit of an Atlantean father figure for Arthur Curry. From what we can see, Arthur's dad is still around, so the fact that he has Volko there as well, you can imagine that there would almost be a little bit of tension. And by that, I mean who should Arthur listen to? Should he listen to his biological and human father? Or Volko, who is an Atlantean and is telling him how to control his abilities and really dig deep into his... Atlantean DNA. So I can imagine there'd be some sort of tension there and grief between Arthur and his human dad. There are so many beautiful things in the underwater world of this trailer, so make sure you tell me what you loved about it. Did you like the underwater ships as they twisted and turned through the city of Atlantis? I think it's Atlantis. It might be another underwater city. Or perhaps are you more excited to see some more land action with Black Manta shooting those flippin' awesome laser beams from his helmet? On a side note, welcome to my Christmas set. It's already falling apart with this bit coming down. I mean, Blue Tack can only do so much. 
I'm also wearing my hot glue t-shirt, so guys, if you haven't seen the cosplay documentary, be sure to click the link and have a view. Don't forget to pop all your thoughts in the comments down below. If you're feeling generous, give us a like, I love that. But with that said, thank you so much for watching. My name is Brittany and you have been watching Brit Girl.